Hello everyone, this is Robeck here from Programming Tips and Tutorials.blogspot.com and today's tutorial is about uh, TCP IP sockets in C language. Uh, the other day I needed to do some code uh, that uh, needed some communication over TCP IP in C language and instead of just going through my stuff, looking on the internet, looking in books for the specific functions to do this, I just searched the internet for uh, already done code for TCP IP communication using server client uh, protocol in C language and I found this interesting uh, blog or website called uh, Tech Talks this is a pretty much a, as the title says a technical blog uh, that as information of um, lots of languages and in this uh, specific post I found TCP IP um, codes and UDP codes for uh, lots of languages like uh, Java, C, um, Perl, Python uh, and uh, I found this really interesting and today's tutorial is just uh, explaining how you can uh, compile the TCP IP uh, server client program in C language and run it to be able to put that code into your programs. I will be leaving this uh, URL in the post so you can c just come here and download the codes too. Um, and basically if you download the TCP IP um code you get two files the tcp client and the tcp server uh, both of them point c of course so what you need to do to run these codes is first compile those codes then um execute them but first of all we just gotta look at the code i'm not j going to explain the the full code um here uh, but uh, I'm just gonna say what you need to run this. So first of all, uh, in the server, you need to specify the port that you will open for uh, listening to TCP IP clients. So the port that we are using is this one right here, 9005. So in the client side, we need to uh, configure the IP of the host, in this case I will be running both codes in the same machine, so is the 127.0.0.1 aka localhost, because they are in the same PC and also need to specify the port exactly the same as I defined it in the server, 9005 so after we have this uh, configured we can just Compile, compile both codes and run it. Let's. Um, I'm gonna do it from the beginning. So I, I have my folder here in the desktop. So I'm gonna see CD desktop and go into the folder. As you can see, I have here both both files. So I'm gonna start by compiling the TCP server. So ECC tcp server uh, less o uh, this less o is to generate the executable file and we gotta give uh, some name to the executable file I'm gonna call it uh, tcp server so compile it give me some warning about the get s functions not get s function not a big deal but uh, it's always good to try not to have warnings in your code so if I check now I have an executable file it's better to see it right here executable file for, for the TCP server uh, in the other hand I gotta do the same I gotta go to the to the folder and the three files here and I'm gonna apply the same s script to the TCP client. So GCC, GCC is the uh, compiler for C language. Uh, 
TCP client dot C S O and again the same name TCP client again the same warning and now we got two executables so first of all so we can communicate in a server client protocol first we need to put the server running and then we can connect the client to the server that is already running so to execute uh, C code in um, in a Linux environment in a, in a shell you do point you do slash and you call your function so in this case TCP server so TCP server is ready is running and it says TCP server waiting for clients on port 9000 so this is a mistake of the the print yeah we can just quickly solve this I just cancelled the, the program so let's do it the right way so we have here a print so we need to put our print exactly the same of our port 9005 then we save when we alter a code we need to compile it again now it's compiled now we run it and it says TCP server waiting for clients on port 9005 so our client is now able to connect to the server because it's already running so we run TCP client and we got here something in this side I got a connection from 127.0.0.1 uh, and I can um, send, send something I'm gonna say hi and we gonna receive here hi receive data equals to hi and I think I can send something to the other side too I'm gonna say hi to you too and I received here hi to you too this is like a MSN application or a Google talk application here over TCP IP socket actually you can you can build one uh, Google talk like application using this uh, methodology so this is pretty much what you get uh, you can just check the code download it I'm gonna uh, put there the the link for the website I'm also gonna put uh, these files in some place like Megapod or rapid share and leave the link after you can download it you can look at the, the code and if you have any questions you can ask you can comment and uh, if you have any questions about the TCP or UDP code in the other language like Python, Perl, C or Java you can leave the, the questions too I will have uh, uh, all the pleasure in try to to help if I know so this is pretty much uh, this uh, I just wanted to give you the this code examples and just explain you the basics of running a C program and the basics of the uh, how to compile and r use these codes so you can learn something with that or use it for any uh, thing that you want so uh, I hope it helped and see you next time